This problem deals with standard deviation, and it's important to remember that standard deviation measures the spread of the variables, um, or how far away the, vari the, the variables are from the mean. Now, when we look at these test scores, 61, 65, 73, 79, 67, um, they're considerably lower than the test scores of the other five students who were in the 80s and 90s, which simply means that the average or the mean of quantity B will be greater than the average or the mean of quantity A. However, upon closer investigation, we, that, we see that 61 and 81 are exactly 20 units apart. 65 and 85, again, 20 units apart, 73, 93, and, and, and so on. They're all exactly 20 units apart, which means that the spread of those variables from the mean will be exactly the same. Therefore, we can assume that quantity A and B are equal.